Hi friends, this is Mehmushik and from past few videos I'm working on developing a classified website like OLX and Quicker using PHP's one of the widely used framework Laravel and I'm using 5.8 version of Laravel framework for developing uh, my classified website okay but now in my last video I discussed how to integrate uh, authentication functionality with our application with which users or admin can register uh, themselves and they can log in okay and in this video i will discuss about uh, changing the users page okay so now whatever data or whatever page you are looking at here in um, in my ad zone website this is the this is a users page okay this is a users section where users can view their advertisement after publishing okay so now i will set i will create a controller with a name as users controller and i will create a view as users okay so that whenever someone some user open this website it should be it should, uh, they should be displayed users page okay so now uh, for doing that first we need to create few folders inside our project okay so this is my add zone project okay and inside views i will right click and then i will click new folder and I'll make a folders admin and i will make one other folder as users okay inside the admin folder i will store all the views related to admin and inside the users folder i will store all the templates or views related to users okay inside this users i will create a file the name as user user dot blade dot php okay you know let's say h1 okay. welcome to level 5.8 okay so now instead of this uh, where this welcome dot blade dot php which you can see here this is the welcome dot blade dot php okay so instead of loading this welcome view i will be i will load this user view okay so for doing that first i need to create a controller okay so for creating the controller i need to go to the command prompt okay and then i need to go to c drive and from that cd zamp cd shidox okay and then cd add zoom okay so now i am in my project okay so here i will use the command as php artisan make controller users controller okay users controller and now i will hit enter okay now you will see a uh, controller automatically gets created here as you can see here users controller gets created okay so now i will create a function inside this users controller public function index okay okay and inside this index function i will call my users view which i have just created just few minutes back okay so this is my users view user view okay so i will try to return view okay and my user view is present inside users folder okay users is the name of the folder inside which my user view is there okay i will just save it and here that that's it guys okay so and now i need to come to my web.php file and here i need to set a route okay so instead of this route i will create one more route get okay directory okay and then users controller at index okay so now i have created a route uh, 
which says instead of loading inst instead of redirecting the user to the welcome template i am telling here redirect the user to the index function of users controller okay so this is my users controller and inside the users controller i have created the function that's what i have mentioned here inside this uh, here okay as you can see here in, inside the users controller i have created the index function so uh, whenever user is on the base url then i'll be loading the user template or the user view okay and immediately this controller will get called and inside this controller index function will get called immediately and user view will get loaded okay so now just save it and now let's refresh okay now you can see instead of uh, laravel it's displaying welcome to laravel 5.8 that means it's now it's loading this user.blade.php okay now what i will do is instead of displaying this welcome to laravel 5.8 message i will make some changes in this uh, user dot blade dot php file i will call the layout okay okay so i will this is my app dot blade dot php okay so i will be calling my layout file which is app okay so for calling that i will type at extends layout dot app okay layouts dot app okay and then i will create a section and call a section okay content end section okay so now let us see what will happen okay so when we call our layouts file now you can see it start displaying me a navigation menu okay with few options like login and register so where, since we had uh, already since we have already integrated login and register functionality so we don't have to worry about anything okay so now we can we can easily register and we can allow the admin to log in to our application okay so now this laravel logo name and these links are coming from this app.blade.php okay so our view is coming our this view is coming from this app.blade.php file okay so uh, later on we will see how we can customize this navigation menu to appear like this okay so that we will see in our next video uh, till then goodbye guys i hope you like this video i hope you got some useful and valuable information out of this video if you like this video click on like button share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching